The speedster name is one of the most evocative in the history of Porsche. To commemorate its famous 50s forebear, a limited edition 911 speedster will go on sale in January 2011. As a homage to the original 356 speedster, only 356 examples of this low-slung, open-top two-seater will be made, so seeing one will be a rare sight. The characteristic rear-engine chassis features the best from the current 911 generation. A 3.8-liter flat-six tuned to deliver 408 horsepower with an average fuel consumption of 27.43 miles per gallon, and the seven-speed Porsche PDK gearbox, which delivers power via a limited slip differential to the rear axle. Designed and conceived by the Porsche exclusive department in Stuttgart, the two-seater 911 Speedster is significantly different from the other members of the 911 family. Every Porsche Speedster was traditionally distinguished by its shortened windscreen and sleek tail. The new 911 features a 40 millimeter lowered and raked windscreen and the characteristic double bubble hardcover for the manual soft top. The sporting flavor is enhanced further by the pure blue exterior color that has been developed exclusively for the Speedster and which provides an intriguing contrast with the two front lights. Measuring speeds in excess of 150 miles per hour. Nothing is slowing this guy down. Interceptor assistance is on route to your location. Interceptor unit is on scene. I'm standing down. is deployed directly ahead of you. What's the load? Suspect is escaping. Please maintain pursuit.
The Super Snake is a package offered by Shelby to enhance the power and looks of the Ford Shelby GT500. Everything a balls-to-the-wall muscle car needs. With an increase of 16 horsepower of boost on the Whipple Supercharger, the peak power of the 5.4-liter V8 has been increased from 550 bhp at 6,500 rpm to 750 bhp at 6,200 rpm. If the driver is able to harness all this extra power, they will complete the standing quarter mile in 12 seconds flat, with a speed of 120 miles per hour at the line. The hood is now one giant air scoop designed to push as much air into the supercharger as possible. A prominent carbon fiber splitter can also be seen, which will certainly help push the front tires into the road when trying to corner while accelerating.
Suspect vehicles have been stopped. Good job, officer. The Porsche 959 with its electronically controlled all-wheel drive was originally conceived as a Group B car. The road-going version created to satisfy homologation regulations that required a minimum of 200 street legal units to be built. The road car became the world's fastest street legal production car with a top speed of 197 miles per hour and was hailed as the most technologically advanced road-going sports car ever built. Instead of creating an engine from scratch, Porsche developed an existing engine ending up with a twin turbocharged six-cylinder boxer engine with an air-cooled block and water-cooled heads. The use of sequential twin turbochargers allowed for smooth, seamless delivery of power across the engine RPM band, which contrasted to the sudden delivery of power found in other turbocharged engines of this period. Instead of using a tubular space frame, which would have saved weight, Porsche chose to use a steel monocoque, which reduced cost and would be easier to translate to future models. The pursuit of lightness and aerodynamics was, however, a big focus for the body, which was made from Kevlar and was a pioneering feature of the mid-80s. Its big front air dam and huge rear spoiler were created from time spent in the wind tunnel and contributed to an impressive drag coefficient of 0.31.
Spike strips are now authorized over. Suspect has missed the spike strip. Suspect has missed the spike strip. Better luck next time. Over. Batch, I uh, don't think he'll be troubling us again. Be on guard. Officers have the suspect in custody. This thing is over. The spirit of performance. The record-breaking CCX Competition Coupe 10th Anniversary Edition was developed to deliver superior performance both on the track and on the road. With no gadgets or unnecessary features, every aspect of this machine serves a fundamental purpose, to reach ultimate speeds and efficiencies. Re-engineered to comply with stringent new US regulations, the CCX builds on the CC lineage of Koenigsegg cars. The supercharged 4.7 liter V8 built by Koenigsegg, combined with an ultra lightweight chassis, gives you a very impressive 683 bhp per ton. A scoop on the bonnet, redesigned front lamps and side skirts help to distinguish this Koenigsegg from the others and improve on what was already insane performance numbers. Zero to 60 miles per hour in 3.2 seconds and a top speed of over 240 miles per hour. to all units. Officers require assistance on Eagle Crest Road. Interceptor, this is an emergency situation.
After 40 years as Lamborghini's test driver, Valentino Balboni has been honored with a car that bears his name. Hired in 1967 by the company's founder, Ferruccio Lamborghini, he has helped develop the character of many classic cars, including the Miura. It was evident early on that Balboni had a special feel for the cars he worked on, with him saying in 1973, a Lamborghini must always combine the precision of a race car with the reliability of a good friend. The 250 LP552s that will be built are made even more desirable by being the only Lamborghinis currently in production that are rear-wheel drive. A white and gold stripe runs the entire length of the car and is inspired by classic sports cars of the 1970s. These distinctive colors are found inside the car as well, with the center console being upholstered in striking polar white leather. to all units. Offices require assistance on Oakmont Valley. All units respond. This is an emergency situation.
Still in Porsche, spotted on Boulder Road. Suspect is believed to be a known street racer and enjoys evading pursuits. Engaging intercepted unit, proceed with caution.
has evaded the spike strip. Repeat, suspect evaded spike strip. Maintain the suit. Suspect is out of range. EMP lock on failed. Engineering the future of speed enforcement. Announcing the ultimate upgrade to your shredder technology. NDLS, the multiple device launching system. Double your stopping power. Deploy two shredders at once. Rolling out across the SCPD today.
Local EMPs are authorized for use. Suspect has missed the spike strip. Suspect... Back in custody, this thing is over.